yes friends as part of this session let us understand about one very good interview question what is that means how to create our own immutable class getting how to create immutable class okay observe what is that question how to create how to create immutable class okay immutable class it is simple first uh, let us understand about immutable okay later we go and write our own immutable class okay observe here it is simple it is simple it will be a dead similar to uh, one of the concept called singleton okay it will be similar to singleton concept okay observe here first uh, what is this immutable immutable terminology meaning okay immutable means not adjusting getting not adjusting okay it represents uh, not adjusting okay I won't adjust not adjust okay meaning observe here if there is any object getting if there is any object getting and if it is having any content or data getting there is one object and and that object is having data getting by by using a method observe here you're having one class a okay if you're having one class a int i equals to double nine let it be static variable now now i want to print this variable i value that is i is having value as what double nine i want to print this variable value hmm. at console think that there is one console to us getting if i do compile this program let it be a dot java okay a dot java and if i run this one uh, i want to get output as what double nine what we have to write here to get output at console as double nine hmm. what we have to do you have to hmm, you have to write a main getting public static void main observe this part carefully okay sop of i static variable can be accessed directly within static area getting sop of i now we can see double line as output at console getting at our command prompt getting we can see that one as output if you do observe this part carefully how you are accessing data hmm, through methods okay through methods only we are accessing hmm, data to perform any actions getting these methods are must getting methods are must without these methods we cannot do anything getting because of methods we are doing some activity at our programming languages okay now observe now observe i hope you understand this one through methods only you can do anything it is like a behavior it is like a activity which can perform by this class a object okay now observe here okay observe through methods only you can do any thing okay now observe this part there is one object within that object you are having data getting now now i want to access the data from this object what must be there hmm, there should be method earlier we have seen that one getting static int i equals to double and public static void main sop of i there must be a method to access getting to perform any activity method is must that activity can be can be accessing or changing or other one is what 
accessing or changing means everything comes accessing means printing getting uh, changing means what increasing decreasing getting increasing or decreasing okay now observe here through methods only public static void main method only or else by using any method it can be an instance method or it can be a static method you can perform your mm, required action getting you can change the data you can mm, you can access the data also okay now now think that there is one x method getting one x method it is having some code to access this object data getting this object data i want to convey only one thing if you want to perform activities like printing or changing that is increasing or decreasing that can be done only by using methods okay i hope you get this one okay now understand okay through methods only you can perform all of those things okay no need to go much here okay observe now now this object is not adjusting object getting not adjustable object that is immutable object okay it is what immutable object what is not adjusting means observe here we can perform some activities like what changing the data other one is what accessing the data through which one through methods okay through methods uh, we can perform these two activities changing data other one what accessing the data of an object okay now by using one method think that you are having one method here okay you are having some method how it is going to work i'll discuss okay we'll go from Found you okay. Observe now it's having some logic to change the data, it is going to increase the data, or else this method is going to decrease the data. Getting it is going to increase the data, or else it is going to decrease the data. It is having these two nature any one nature is available here let it be some x method having that implementation to change the data that is increasing or decreasing getting increasing or decreasing getting changing the data means what increasing or decreasing now now if this object observe here if this object if this object is not allowing this method to change the data earlier what is the actual data here actual data was till here okay now if this object is not changing if it is not adjusting to to perform some changing within its area getting if this object is not allowing this method to not change the data getting then this object is called as not adjusting object that is immutable observe here if this object is not allowing this method to do changes to its data within its object then this object is what not adjustable object that is immutable object and these methods uh, when they will execute hmm, these methods when they will execute at uh, run time getting at run time and uh, these objects uh, will not uh, get adjust because they are not adjusting object okay think that some x object or y object okay some y object is having not adjusting nature okay now it is having one good feature what is that means you can access its data that is you can you can print its data getting 
you can print its data now observe here you can print its data getting now it is having one mm, one good feature what is that accessing other feature is what it will not allow methods to change its data within its object getting if any object is having such a type of methodology or such a type of mechanism then that object object corresponding skeleton class let it be y object then corresponding class y is called as immutable class and this object is called as immutable object okay getting friends what we have understood to access data to change data to perform any activity in any programming language you can do perform those things only by using what hmm only by using methods okay so best example is what if there is a class a if there is a class a and if you are having one variable if you are having one variable as what if you are having one variable as static int i getting equals to triple nine now i want to print this triple nine at console what we have to do if i do compile and if i if i if i run this piece of code what happens it will compile successfully it will give output as nothing i mean at console there won't be anything to us now i want to print this data it is a i referring value is what triple line to console what we have to do here mm, what we have to do simply put sop of i getting so at console you can see data as what output as triple nine how we are getting that output because of this code within the public static void main method only through methods we can print the data you can change the data of object getting data of object this is static variable it won't be available within object getting if it is like if it is like instance variable then how to access how to access simple create object a equals to new a okay then also you required what method without method you cannot do anything accessing changing can be done only by using methods this is the rule to each and every programming language they are having some rules okay through methods we can perform some methods can do some activities what are those activities Hmm. changing the data accessing the data getting changing can be uh, increasing or decreasing the data getting it will have different meaning with different data types if it is like if it is like uh, int data type int i is equals to double nine now decreasing means what if i change this value to 98 it is decreasing with respect to the float double each and everything will be as what decreasing only and if it is like a boolean b is equals to false if i change this one to true what is this changing okay? but it will be as what increasing increasing from false to true i have increased its meaning it i increased its meaning nature if it is like string s equals to an l getting now observe here if i change this one to an l mohandu what it is increasing getting changing can be increasing or decreasing here length of the string increasing getting you can achieve all of those things through methods okay now observe now observe here okay if you understand this one and remaining part will be simple okay simple now this part is simple now observe here okay through methods what we can do we can access we can hmm, change the data and what is immutable immutable means simple thing put one thing in your brain not adjusting meaning if an object not not allowing 
not allowing methods to change data within its area then that object is said to be what immutable object this nature is called not adjusting nature and the corresponding class to this object is called as immutable class this nature class only we have to develop this logic related class we have to develop that is what how to create immutable class okay now observe here and because of because of this immutable getting because of this immutable nature what we are having number one what is that can access the data other one is what what is happening it will not allow us to perform changes within object data getting not allow getting getting not allow meaning is what it is not adjusting not adjusting to to change the data data within within its object area getting within its object area and we are having one good feature what is that can access the data immutable nature immutable object nature is what you can access the data getting you can access data now observe here this is called as immutable object okay but i have one small requirement getting i want to access this object data getting object data i know that it will not allow me to change the hmm, data within its area but i want to access this data can we access yes you can access getting so now think that